Reggie here, your friendly neighborhood bodybuilder and comic book collector, and I want to welcome you to another one of my videos. In this video, I am going to show you guys a cool, amazing Spider-Man comic that recently came into my possession. And this is one of the last remaining books that I actually need for my run on Amazing Spider-Man, the 1 through 261 portion of the run. So I'm going to show you that. And then I'm also going to open up two AOKs that have made their way to me from two subscribers out there. And so what I think I'm going to do is open one AOK, show you guys the ASM, open the second AOK. I think that's how we're going to do it. And so this first AOK is actually from Mike C. I think it's Flexor Daz. I literally just finished talking to this guy a couple of moments ago. He actually sent me this. I want to say maybe a week ago. I'm just now getting around to doing this video, but I was literally talking to him a couple of moments ago on Instagram. And so it's uh, kind of timely that I'm about to do this video right now. But he sends me a note on a backing board, which I'm a fan of. It says, hope you like. Thanks for everything you do for comics and comic collectors. So that was really nice, nice little uh, message there. And what he sent over to me, I think is really cool. Actually, I already know what it is. It is a Spider-Man Far From Home custom edition number one comic. And this is actually from Kellogg's. I guess this was something to do with the Literacy Foundation uh, having a collaboration with Kellogg's. I want to say he actually had to buy some cereal or like multiple boxes of cereal to get this thing. So this is really cool. Uh, this is, uh, again, Spider-Man Far From Home. It is a comic. It is only a couple of pages here. It is really, really thin. But it is actually a pretty cool cover. Pretty cool cover right there. So uh, Mike... I definitely appreciate you hooking me up with this brother. Thank you very much. Uh, I am there's somebody I'm going to ask to see if that that's their artwork. Um, Scott Johnson, he does some stuff, and I wonder if this is Scott's artwork. So I'm going to have to ask him about that. But definitely a cool book. So thank you, sir, for that. I definitely appreciate it. Um, let's do the book that I picked up. This is a book that I have had in my hands so many times over the last couple of months and consistently I have passed on it because I always felt that the the price was too high for the condition of the book that I was looking at and I was actually able to pick this one up from uh, Reese Reese's Comics. I am really starting to be a fan of Reese's Comics. They have a great selection. They have, I think, books at affordable prices. And what's great about their website is they actually give you the ability to make an offer on the book. And the, the site has logic built into it where if your offer is too low, it kind of lets you know that. But if your offer is within their range that is acceptable, the offer is allowed to go through. And then with, within you know a day or so, they actually respond to you and let you know whether your offer has been rejected or accepted and stuff like that. What's really cool is that by and large, their prices are right at FMV. Well, let me restate. The price that I offer them is basically at FMV and in four cases, four or five cases, they have actually accepted my offer every time. And so I'm definitely pleased with that. Great books, fair price. You really can't ask for more than that. And so this is a book that, again, just uh, arrived about a week ago. I'm just now getting around to doing the video. Uh, so it's actually been sitting here, but it is... Uh, Amazing Spider-Man number 101. Again, a book that you guys have heard me talk about a lot. I finally have it. It is finally here. Uh, and it is, it's cool. It's cool to actually have this book in my possession. The story is okay. It's not the greatest story ever. Uh, the cover is okay, but it is a book that I definitely needed for the collection. So this is the first appearance of uh, Morbius, the living vampire. There's also a, a lizard appearance, and this is the last 15 cent issue. If only it on if only it cost me 15 cents to get this thing, but definitely. A really cool book that I'm I'm happy to have in the collection now. I was able to get it for, like I said, a fair price, and it's already slapped, so you, you can't really beat that. 
This uh, next thing that I'm going to open up is actually an AOK -okay from uh, Matthew. Matthew is Mr. Comics 89, doing that off of memory. He sent this to me. There is a card, I'm sorry, an envelope that says open me first. So we are going to attempt to open this thing up. And um, part of the reason why I decided to open this up with that uh, amazing Spider-Man 101 is because uh, he is a fan of Spider-Man. And so an A-OK -okay from a Spider-Man guy leads me to believe that there may be a Spider-Man something or another in here. So he says, hey, Reggie, congratulations again on reaching 5,000 subs. I just want to thank you for everything that you do for both myself and the comic book community. You have been an inspiration to me, helping me to evolve in my comic collecting, as well as becoming an even bigger, amazing Spider-Man fan. Yes, I give you credit by showing all those amazing and beautiful covers. How can I not get more excited about Spider-Man? Really hope you enjoy this A-OK -okay for me. It's something I've been meaning to send off for a while, but this is the first chance I had to do it. I uh, said it made it him, he made it himself personally for me from one Spider-Man fan to another and as brothers in the Gibbing gang. <laughs> this is from Mr. Comic 89 hashtag Gibbing gang, my man. So there we go. So let's crack this thing open and see what it is that he has made and sent to me. And this is one of those things I could have opened it in advance, but I wanted to kind of open it live here. Well live recorded if you will see what's in here crack this thing open there is a bag inside so we're going to open that up there is a bag within that bag Let's see what this is it looks like a painting of some sort i see paint on the top there All right let's see what this is see what this is yep it is a painting it says homage to Amazing Spider-Man 50 from one ASM collector to another. Here's my version of ASM 50. I hope you enjoy slash like my painting. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. That is actually pretty good. I don't have this talent. How about that? That is actually pretty good. Mr. Comics 89, my man, this is cool. I don't have an artistic bone in my body. I can tell you that, but this is this is awesome, brother. Thank you very much. We are going to uh, to put this on display in the back there, just as soon as this video airs. That way, I don't give it away. But this is really cool. This is you can you can feel this is real paint. That's crazy. That is crazy. That's awesome. I I say it all the time that I have some of the best subscribers out there, and uh, it is very very true as evidenced by the wonderful gifts that you guys send me. I really do appreciate this. All right, so with that, uh, now I understand why he wrote, fragile, do not bend all over. <laughs> it's like, don't mess up my original artwork. Uh, anyway, I want to thank you guys for taking the time to watch this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, give the video a thumbs up. I look forward to mixing it up with you guys in the comment section, as always. And if you need to reach out to me, feel free to do so. Reggie Collects on Instagram and ReggieCollects at gmail.com. Take care. One last thing. If you're interested in picking up an awesome slab for your collection, this is your chance. Here is the book that we are giving away as part of the Go Collect giveaway that we do every single week here on the channel. This is Captain American Annual Number One. This is a Wolverine appearance. What makes this really cool is that it is a classic Wolverine versus Captain America cover that I personally love. Uh, the book is even more special because it is signed twice. It is signed by Mike Zeck and also John B Betty, I think that's how you say it, Betty, Betty, signed by John on <laughs> the cover. Uh, they signed it back in 09, so this is like an OG uh, CGC slab, 9.6, definitely a really cool book right there. And if you are interested in adding this book to your collection, the phrase that you need is Zek. Z-E-C-K. Zek is the phrase that you need. All you have to do is head over to the community tab, find the post in which I talk about this book, click the MailChimp link, go to MailChimp, plug in three pieces of information. Two of them are related to you. One of them is the phrase that I just gave you, which is Zek. 
plug that in and you are automatically entered into the contest to win this very cool book from Go Collect. Next, you tune in to the Ready, Set, Go preview show, which airs every single Sunday night at 7.30 p.m. Pacific time to find out if you are the winner. All that we ask is that you be a subscriber of the channel, you be a resident of the U.S., a resident of Canada, or or have a mail-in address in the U.S., and this book could be yours. If you have any issues, questions, comments, thoughts, or concerns, don't hesitate to send me a message to Reggie Collects on Instagram or an email to ReggieCollects at gmail.com. Good luck.